Welcome to Big Day of Giving 2022. Before we begin, note that in the side chat bar, you will see that we've dropped some helpful links to things such as the registration page, the BDOG 2022 calendar, the nonprofit resource toolkit, and the link to these slides and transcripts. Shout out to Davis Phoenix Collection, who shared this picture from Big Day of Giving 2021 on their Facebook page. We want to thank Western Health Advantage, who has come back again as our lead sponsor. We are so grateful for all they do to make Big Day of Giving possible. Only with the help of community partners like Western Health could we facilitate this region-wide philanthropic effort each year. So thank you to their team there. Before we begin, we wanted to make it clear that this orientation is specifically only for returning team captains and participants. If your organization has never participated in Big Day of Giving, or this is your first time helping your organization's campaign, please go watch the newbie orientation located on the registration page, as this video does not cover everything you need to know as a new participant. I'm Monica Hallman, Program Manager, here with my colleague Vasey Komen, Marketing Director, and we will be your guides through today's presentation, as well as your contacts on the Big Day of Giving team at the Sacramento Region Community Foundation, the organization that coordinates Big Day of Giving. The foundation is proud to have brought this annual Giving Day to the community for the past decade, along with our other philanthropic services, community leadership initiatives, and grant opportunities. Learn more on our website. Thanks, Monica. Big Day of Giving 2022 will be held from midnight to 11.59 p.m. on Thursday, May 5th, 2022. As in past years, there will be a two-week early giving period starting April 21st. Please mark your calendars, your team's calendars, your friends' calendars, and family's calendars. Don't forget, Big Day of Giving 2022 is Thursday, May 5th. So here's a quick look at the history of Big Day of Giving. And as you can see in the past nine years, over 700 organizations like yours have raised a collective $65 million to advance your missions in the Ford County region through Big Day of Giving. We are so, so excited to kick off this 10th year of giving and continue to build on this philanthropic movement that brings our community together every year. So thank you for continuing to be a part of it. Eligibility requirements for nonprofits have not changed since last year, as you can see. If you have any organizational changes or are not sure if you're still eligible, just ask us. Email us at bdog at sacreachcf.org and we're happy to help you. To make sure that you are registered for Big Day of Giving, visit bigdayofgiving.org backslash bdog2022 and click register and fill out the registration form and pay your registration fee. Then you can start working on your Giving Edge profile edits and submit them for approval. Note that the deadline for registration is January 10th and the deadline to submit your initial profile edits is January 31st. However, if you want to be eligible for the early dog prize, which I'll detail in a bit, you will need to submit your profile by January 10th, which is the same day that registration closes and three weeks earlier than the initial profile edit deadline. Registration fees remain mainly the same with one notable difference being that we now have a budget category for those who are $50,000 or under in annual operating budgets. If your nonprofit's annual operating budget is under $50,000, the participation fee you'll be prompted to pay during the online registration is $50. Thanks to the team at the Chat Center for sharing this sweet photo with us. As a reminder, the Early Dog Prize is awarded to 10 organizations who submit their profiles by January 10th. Winners will receive $500 prize towards their B-Dog campaign. All organizations that submit their profile edits fully complete to the best of their ability by this early deadline will be entered into this drawing. If you do not wish to be in the running, you have until January 31st to submit your initial profile. Remember that submitting your profile early helps give Giving Edge coaches more time to review your profile and provide faster feedback to help you with your edits. We really recommend not waiting till the last minute. Our Giving Edge coaches, Jessica and Morgan, will review your edits as you submit them for approval, 
and will contact your organization's team captain if additional changes or updates are needed. They are also available for one-on-one -on -one check ins in December and January if you're having trouble editing your profile. And in the spirit of kicking off our 10th year with a bang, we have exciting news. If you have not yet heard, we've recently moved technology platforms, and we're excited to announce that we are now partnering with Mighty Cause to provide a more user friendly platform. We also heard from feedback from a handful of participants last year that BDOC is great, but simpler is better. Through our new platform and our streamlined registration requirements, we are responding to this feedback and we are so grateful for it. There are many new features and upgrades that come along with this change and we will pro be providing more details on it, them as May approaches. We know that any new changes are bound to come with growing pains, but we are confident that this new platform will provide many new opportunities and solutions to make things easier for you and your donors. We appreciate your patience in advance as just like you, we are getting familiar with the upgraded platform as well. Know that we and the Mighty Cause support team are here to help you through this transition. Need more help navigating the new system? Fear not. In addition to the normal resources and boot camps that we provide, we will have a training in November to walk you through everything on your new dashboard, as well as additional trainings next spring to help answer any of your questions about using the platform for Big Day of Giving. All will be recorded and shared in the nonprofit resources page after they occur. Over the past several months, we have worked hard to make sure that all of your profile details and donor data have been securely moved to the new platform. If you had an admin account on the previous Giving Edge platform, all you need to do is reset your password, if you have not done so already, to access your organization's Giving Edge profile. To reset your password, click the user icon in the top right hand corner of the Giving Edge website, type in your email address that you use to log into your nonprofit account on the old platform, and then click Forgot Password. Once you log in, you should be able to click on the user icon again and see your organization name listed under Organization. Once you click on the name, you will be taken to your nonprofit dashboard. Again, we will have a training in November to go over the nonprofit dashboard in depth, but I will spend just a few moments showing you the basics of the site. On the right hand menu, you will see announcements where we will post important information, as well as if you scroll down, you will see that the resources are linked to in the announcement as well. To close the announcements, you will want to click the arrow to collapse it and you can reopen it by clicking show announcements. Once you have completed registration uh, and paid your fees, you will see that it will say that your registration is pending. Once you have completed all of the items on your to do list, it will say that your registration is approved. At the top, you will see a to-do list, which lists all of the things that you still need to complete in order to participate in Big Day of Giving, including filling out your profile and submitting your profile for review. If you see a red dot next to your to-do list, it means that there are still items that need to be complete. If you click on that item, it will take you directly to where it needs to be completed. Use the left-hand dashboard to navigate the back end of your site. On the overview page, you will see some basic metrics on your profile, including recent donations, profile views, and shares that you can add or remove from your profile. Click the organization page to edit your nonprofit's Giving Edge pro profile. When editing your profile, you will see this edit toggle that will allow you to switch between editing and the public view of your profile. You will also see, also see pencil icons and plus icons that will allow you to edit different sections of your pro profile. When editing, make sure that you click save in order to save your changes after you have made an edit. While we have migrated over all profiles, we have tried our best to simplify them as well so you, you may not see some sections that we have taken out. But don't worry if you need any of the text that you believe was in your old profile, such as the leadership statement, you can email us 
and we will provide you with the language, which you can update in your in new profile in the new system. Note that on the new profile, your edits will be live on the site as soon as you make them. This change, we hope, will make the process of updating your Giving Edge profile easier and more fun than before. As in the past, our Giving Edge coaches will review your profile before it, it's marked with an official reviewed by the pro foundation badge. And your profile must be submitted for review by the deadlines I mentioned to participate in Big Day of Giving. We are currently onboarding the Giving Edge coaches to the new system, which is why, depending on when you're watching this recording, the Submit Profile for Review feature may not yet be active. When it is, simply click it and it will alert the Giving Edge coaches that you have changes that have been added to their queue to review. Back in the dashboard under Fundraising Tools, you will see all the tools to build peer-to-peer -peer pages, which is now a year-round functionality, and templates to share with your supporters, get code and embedded donations on your website, add matching grants, and create volunteer opportunities associated with your organization. Please note that some of the features are marked advanced and grayed out. These tools are available through monthly annual paid subscriptions with Mighty Cause, the new technology platform provider, and there are a few other, others listed under integrations. You may find these tools helpful, but these features are not required to run a successful Big Day of Giving campaign. To use them, your organization will need to set up a plan with Mighty Cause. The foundation is not involved with this transaction and for the sake of full transparency does not benefit from the purchase of the advanced features or paid plans. We are, however, very grateful to the Mighty Cause team who graciously agreed to offer the volunteer opportunities at Google Analytics and Facebook Pixel integration to nonprofits with Giving Edge profiles at no cost. Under Reports, you will be able to see all of your donors. Under Checkout, you can customize some of the language that donors see on their, their receipts and donation form and thank you page. Under Settings, you will be able to change your URL Set up your leadership demographics, manage your users who have access to your nonprofit's profile, edit the recipients of your Giving Edge e-checks, set what appears when your profile is shared on social media, and more. We encourage you to log in and start looking around to get to know where things are. As we noted earlier, if you are working on your Giving Edge profile edits early on in the registration period, you may not see the button to submit your edits for review, but this is what it will look like. Once you click the gray button and your edits are reviewed, a Giving Edge coach will reach out to you if your profile requires any additional edits or to let you know that your profile and registration for Big Day of Giving are complete. After this happens, you will see a badge that says that your profile has been reviewed by the Sacramento Region Community Foundation. All of the same resources as in past years will be available, including boot camps, which we hope to be able to hold as a hybrid in-person element, as well as live streaming model, additional platform trainings, the Facebook learning community, the Bark e-newsletter, Q&A hours, networking events, which we hope to also hold in person, our team of mentors, who you can find in the mentor search, which is linked in the nonprofit resource toolkit, Giving Edge Coach office hours, as well as all other resources like the user guide and the eight week work plan. Check out the new nonprofit resource toolkit linked in the chat to find these resources. In regards to holding events in person, we will continue to monitor what is safe to do so and keep you updated as they get closer. In addition to all those resources, you also have access to the Big Day of Giving Marketing Toolkit your one-stop shop for turnkey items to help you promote your organization's participation in Big Day of Giving to your audiences. Available now are the Big Day of Giving 2022 logos, as well as a few save the date graphics. In 2022, we'll have a full library of material, including a ton of social media graphics, non-English graphics, customizable social media graphics, and print media files, templates for social media and email messages, and much more. <laughs> if there's something you'd like to see in the marketing toolkit uh, that doesn't already exist, 
please email us and let us know if we can make it happen. We absolutely will. Another reminder that like in the past, we will be using e-checks to distribute funds received during Big Day of Giving Giving Window, which will be sent to the designated person on your team no later than June 30th, 2022. E-checks enable us to get you your funds faster than traditional checks and are safe and efficient and can be printed and deposited just as a normal check. For more information on how they work, we will have FAQs available on the website. Some final reminders and important dates to remember. January 10th is the last day to register for BDOG 2022. January 31st is the deadline to submit your initial profile edits. Although we recommend that you get them in early and maybe even a win a prize if you submit them for the early dog prize. April 4th is the deadline to complete all of your required Giving Edge edits. April 21st is the first day that donors can make early gifts. And of course, May 5th is Big Day of Giving. Make sure to check out the full BDOG calendar with details and registration links in the nonprofit resources. Shout out to Shep Heroes for sharing this image of their BDOG dogs during Big Day of Giving 2021. As there is confusion about this every year, we wanted to remind folks that Giving Edge is a year round resource where donors can learn and donate to nonprofits anytime, not just on Big Day of Giving. Because of this, you will wanna make sure that you do not start instructing donors to donate too early. Only gifts made during early giving, beginning on April 21st through Big Day of Giving on May 5th will be counted towards your BDOG total. Before we end orientation, we wanted to ask that you help us make Big Day of Giving 2022 as responsive as possible by completing a short survey. This will help us organize training and bootcamp content to what people want, as well as get a sense of who would like more time with mentors and how many lawn signs people may want. You can find the link to this survey in the chat bar next to this recorded video and also in the registration form. As a final note, we want to remind everyone that due to the large number of partners we work with, we are not able to accept phone calls or visits to our office related to Big Day of Giving. We are a super small team. Frankly, it's mostly just Monica. So please email us if you have any questions and we'll be sure to respond as quickly as possible. The email address is bdog at sacregecf.org. Thank you all so much for continuing to be a part of this special event and for all the important work that you do in the community. We are excited to work with you again this year.